Hello, good evening, everybody. All right, waiting for some to come on. Gonna give it a few minutes. Let's see. All right, so looks like we got eight on. Welcome, everybody. Let me shout you out, see who's here. Hey, April, you are finally first. Psalms is a close second. Psalms is, is tough. <laughs> hey, Psalms of Flow Grace, Lori, Sarunas, Amy, Sarah, Shalom, Brother James, A Sister Amy Dixon, God bless you. Sis Sister Kathy, Brother Walter, all right, BT in the house. Brother Derek, what's up? Praise the Lord, everybody. Richard, hello. Noel, hello. Sometimes these come up pretty quick and I miss a couple. Brother Robert, Lewis, hello from along the Ohio River. All right. All right. 32, just like that in a minute. Erica, hello. <clears throat> Emmanuel, shalom. Hope everybody had a good day today. <clears throat> Kathy, hey Kathy. So it's the only way to buy Bolt to buy uh, Electronium and exchange it to Bolt. Yes, yep. And Electronium, the tough part is getting Electronium off an exchange, and Coinex enables you to do that. You'd send, I'd send XLM to Co to Coinex. You need to have a VPN on, or they won't let you operate. Um, and uh, and then you'll send it over to MetaMask. But in the electro swap, um, they'll give you directions. You have to uh, set up your MetaMask. Oh, you did it today. Good. Okay. You have to set up your MetaMask to, to receive Electronium. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Great. Cool. Took you a couple of hours. Wow. Wow. Hey, EV Geek. Hello. Hey, Greg. I believe XRP and XLM are currently suppressed as gold and silver, but. How do they do it? I don't know, but I'm in agreement with the EV Geek. Becca, shalom. What's a VPN? It, it's um, it switches your uh, IP address. So if you're trying to log on to an exchange that does not receive IP addresses from the United States, you can make your IP address from, let's say, the United Kingdom. Brother Troy, hello. God bless you all. All right. I'm new. I know nothing about this. All right. No problem. Well, you're in the right place. We're going to help you out. VPN is, you know, what some of us get into some meme coins and coins that are not on the major exchanges. And that's a way to get a hold of them before everyone else does. Or even just to get them, you know, um, there's, there's some good meme coins. Um, so, Anyhow, you know, to get on certain exchanges and to get onto certain platforms to do swaps, sometimes you need a VPN. All right, let's see, Sister Amy. All right, wanted to share with you regarding number seven that our that our preacher had shared in Good Friday that Jesus had injuries in seven different areas of his body. I never realized that before. That is awesome. Wow. Hey, Shannon, I see you. God bless you. Gabriel, hello, hello. Jay, what's up, Jay? Can't keep up with your live streams at the moment. Much love to the community. Many prayers. Thank you, Jay. God bless you. Thanks for at least popping on. That's awesome. <clears throat> All right. I guess we could give it a couple more minutes. I want to pray. You guys heard, you know, about... Another virus going around. It's an election year, blah, blah, blah. But I don't want my attitude to be blah, blah, blah about I, I want to take things seriously. So I definitely, I definitely want to, we're gonna, we're gonna decree Psalms 91 and we're gonna pray together. We're gonna pray together. Jamal, what's up? Yeah, I got a little news clip. I'll, I'll play for you guys in a couple minutes. We'll just let a couple more people come on. I got I felt the Lord show me XRP again today. So I'm just going to share with you. I kind of rearranged some things. If it 
ministers to somebody good if not just stay where you are um amy yes i'm getting anxiety it can be overwhelming yes it can be um becca can i ask how do you use or buy a wallet i heard you need one i'm a senior who's learning um well look up I guess the best way to do it, you can get them on Amazon, but everyone recommends going, what would happen there? Uh, why did that do that? Hold on, guys. I lost my comments. Delete brand. A video will be deleted. What in the world? Okay. Okay. There we go. Hey, JW, God bless you. Old rounder, bro, God bless you. Uh, Sister Becca, check out, write this word down. Look for, just Google it. Tangent wallets are good. They, they're a couple of cards. You're going to download an app. You'll get the cards in the mail. It's like 40, 50 bucks. Uh, this is one of my favorite ones, Tangent. The other day, and the realty company name was, all right. All right, here we go. Sister Amy's in the Holy Ghost. I drive by a house of sale all day. The reality company's name was Stellar. I saw Stellar again today. It stood out to me, NXRP. Um, which I agree with the attitude. Stay as positive as possible. Everyone spent years wasting my time for no reason. That's right. You know, worrying and, you know, that's an attitude too, worrying I heard an awesome saying. My old pastor said it. Worrying is like a rocking chair. It gives you something to do, but takes you nowhere. Uh, Crypto Casey YouTube. Crypto Casey YouTube Tangent. Okay. Hey, Robert. Hello. Ultra Run. Hello. Uh, Becky, you are welcome. Hey, Brother Timothy Smith. God bless you. God bless you. <clears throat> so I was... Um, well, you know, it, it looks like Ledger Nano X Wallet. Yes. Hey, Brother Walter, God bless you. These, well, for me, anyhow, what is that? For me, anyhow, these were these were tough, the Ledger Nanos. I have one. I just, I don't use it. It's, to me, it's just too much. <laughs> Mine glitches and all that. It's got to be plugged in. It's got to sync to my phone. And I was having trouble with all that. Maybe you guys don't. I don't know. Um let me just let me guys show you guys something. Hey James, God bless you. I, I think I showed something like this yesterday, but this came up again. Let me share my screen. Uh, so on April 8th, new instant payments regulations will come into effect. We will see a solar eclipse and NASA will launch three rockets. Coincidence? I don't think so. 224 will be big. And this is, I read this the other day with the, the European Union has today confirmed the new instant payment regulations will come into effect on April 8th, right? So we spoke about this. Um, we spoke about this and I said, you know, what comes to your mind? And um, well, some of the top players, right? Or XRP, XLM, I know guys, so many people are preaching Luna and SHIB as seed coins, but what if they're not? What if they're not? So what I did today, especially as we're coming to April 8th, and the Lord for a couple of years has not showed me XRP. He's been showing me XLM a lot. And then I, if you guys missed my live the other night, I said I had like a vision or a dream. I looked at my feet and like I wear these. You know, I, I wear I wear these when I when I do church online. I have these like Reeboks, like slippers, like sandal slippers kind of deal. And um, it said across the top, it said XRP. And somebody I share it. Somebody and also CERN, Amy. Yep, yep, CERN also. So we're gonna be ready. We're gonna really be firing up prayer, guys. We're gonna fire up prayer. Um, so um, somebody. A brother gave an awesome word. He's like, you know, XRP is going to fund your um, your ministry. 
you know, my ministry started. God brought me to this, brought me to you guys. He said, this is, I want you to pastor this and lead this. Um, so he said, it's going to, it's going to fund your ministry. And, you know, here we are like, <laughs> God, I need funding. And, you know, thank God for everybody that gives and sows. I, I, want, I do want to say this. I know you all can give. Um, I never asked for, for giving or anything, but those that, you know, pay tithes, offerings, giving, whatever it is. I want to ask, I know you could give on here. And if you could only give on YouTube with these supers or whatever they're called, that's fine. But I'm going to ask for the time being, if the Lord presses upon your heart to give, if you could do uh, Venmo, uh, Cash App, or um, PayPal, that would help. That would help me out because that's more direct. I don't get YouTube like whatever for for this month. YouTube pays out the twentieth of the following month, so everything's like pushed out like a month and a half with YouTube. Anyhow, it is what it is. That's I just I just asked. For you know, um, Becca, I have. If are you on my Telegram page? Um, and it's on my it's on my YouTube channel as well. Um, if you go on my YouTube channel, how to give, and then if you go on our Telegram page, there's a there's a giving and sewing, um, which let me see if I could pull that up. Um, Give me one second. Let's see. Let me see if I got it on here. Nope, not on that one. Um, does anybody have it that they could put it in? <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see. Well, I sent it. I sent it to my pastor for a covering. So, no, it's not on there. Let me pull this up for you guys. Because if you guys aren't on, we it's Telegram's been rocking. So I want to put this up there for those that have not been on yet. Um, this way, you all can see it. Let me see. Yeah, here it is. All right. All right, guys. Here is the telegram. Here's the telegram group. Uh, nope, that's the title of my thing. Huh. Hold up. Perfect insight. Um, copy. Let's see. All right, let's try this again. There it is. All right, there's a Telegram group. If you haven't joined, please do. Thompson, I see you on there. God bless you. Um, Brother Ryan, God bless you. Let's see. Let me back up a little bit on here. Anyhow, yeah, so that, that would help me out if you did the Venmo uh cash app or you know for probably you know for the next month or so that would help me out uh instead of just doing these supers on here but if you if that's your only way to give them that, that's fine that's fine but i figured out ask um all right let's see guys let me go all right i see a prayer request but let me let me just say so <clears throat> this is payment system coming in um the lord i, I had xrp you know Fee, we always, for, for dream interpretation, if it's somewhere in the Bible, that's the best interpretation. We judge prophecy by the word of God. We judge everything by the word of God. Shod your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Our feet bring us places. And it brings, we're bringing the gospel. We're bringing the gospel on this YouTube channel. We're bringing the gospel, right? We're sharing the gospel. So, it's interesting that XRP, it said XRP on my feet. It didn't say Luna. It didn't say Sheba. And I, 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 for me, guys, what I, um, I, I just rebalanced my portfolio. I was, I was heaviest in Luna and Shib. XLM, I barely had any XRP, guys, to be honest with you. And then it was, it was 
pretty much XLM. I got a little bit of BNB Tiger stuff. I'm, you know, nothing really to, you know, to talk about right now. But I seen Stellar today. It's interesting. You said you saw Stellar. It, it, it jumped out at me. And I saw it. And then I'm driving and then I see a license plate that says XR. It's the glory of God to conceal a matter. And it's the honor of kings to search it out. So often God wants us to search him out and look for him. I was not look, going around looking for signs. I, I said this a million times. But you know, I know enough. I, I am mature enough in the Lord. I know when God's showing me things. I'm very visual. I, I, the Lord has told me I have a seer anointing on me. So I, I can see things and things jump out to me. And I see XR and I'm like, I giggled and I'm like, Lord, so you tell me the next car I'm going to look at because I was on the highway is going to be a P. And as soon as I turned my head, there was a license plate with a big P right in the middle. And I'm like, okay, Lord. Okay. And, um, and then, I, you know, for, for my portfolio, I felt them. Okay. Well, how many should I have? And he gave me, and, and then he gave me another number. So the number you know, I'm not going to share you guys, you know, numbers. I don't, we don't need, we don't need to do that. Right. But <clears throat> the number, um, let's put it like this. It was, it was, it's more than half my portfolio. Now I have XRP, XLM, Luna and Sheba, right? Nothing new here, but I just want to be prepared. And, you know, I'm, I was running around, you know, some meme coins here and there. I kind of pulled out of a lot of them. Because something is about to happen. You know, our next prayer is, okay, Lord, how much should we put on the wallets right now? God forbid these is worldwide blackouts. Well, can these exchanges black out and zero out? Can they? I don't know. I don't, I hope not. But, you know, let's pray into this a little bit. We want to be wise. As wise as serpents, as, as harmless as doves, the Bible says. Right? Uh, hey, Prince, I see you on there, Thompson. SHX, yeah, good coin. ISO coin. Uh, I mean, uh, hey, Margaret, God bless you. Please, uh, Ryan, you're saying please wrap. I'm not sure what you're saying. Uh, I got some of that in my portfolio. SHX, SHX, sleeping monster. Yes, I agree. Please, yeah, but even more rational and spiritual. Uh, prayers have had two spiritual attacks. Okay, Ryan. All right, Ryan, let me let me bounce up. I'm going to come back down to you because um, there was another prayer request that I wanted to get to. I just wanted to finish what I was saying. Um, V-Chain, yep, yeah, V-Chain's a good coin. Right now, I'm just, I'm really just trying to do what the Lord tells me to do. I'm really, I, I by looking at crypto and I look at projects and I share them with you guys, like, all right, God, I want to dial in because, like, there's some stuff about to hit right now. Guys, also, type in, does any of that register? Is anybody feeling, I really have not been hearing much about XRP from the Lord in, in probably a couple of years. Is anybody else getting anything with XRP lately? Please let us know in the comments below. Uh, let us, XRP is, a, is the future coin, yes. Uh, I thought I saw a prayer request up here, guys, if I'm missing it. Um, all right, let me, let me scroll down. I don't want to miss it. I saw a prayer request. Amy said, I saw a video yesterday where a guy was saying that the actual day of the three days of darkness is Exodus started in 4, 8. That's interesting. Something that we got to pray about. I need God to intervene right now. It's all bad. I can't even say how bad because it's so bad. All right, Alex, we lift you up right now. We pray that God will intervene in your situation. God knows and he's able. We pray God's grace come upon you and God will give you a breakthrough and cover your mind and your heart with peace right now. Alex, we just lift you up to the throne of grace right now in Jesus' name. We pray that God would, would put a multiplicity of his grace upon your life, his enablement on your life in Jesus' name. Becca, walking into XRP blessing. Yeah, walking into the XRP blessing. So that was the other part that I didn't say. Um, before we moved to Texas, my wife had a dream. And um, her sister was in the dream. And her sister set up an account for us. And 
I, I think put money in it and, and we and we knew it was revealed to, it was an account for ministry. So she set up an account for ministry for us. So we knew God was going to fund something and, and enable us to be able to be more involved in ministry. And let me say this. Sometimes in the dreams, guys, look up their name. It might not actually be that person. Sometimes it is. But my wife's sister's name means uh, gift from God or God's gift. So this account that was set up will be a gift from God or God's gift to enable us to minister in Texas and now around the world. Um, okay. Uh, all right, Alex. All right, so we just prayed for you. Um, all right. Let's. All right, Brother Ryan needs to be covered in prayers. Let's, let's cover Brother Ryan in prayers. Ryan, we lift you up right now in the name of Jesus Christ, and we pray that the Lord would cover you right now. We pray that he would put his grace upon you, his mercy, and his love would overwhelm you right now. We bind every spirit of hindrance and opposition, every spirit of attack, every lying spirit that's coming against you. We bind in Jesus' name, we cast out. We speak for your mind and your heart to be loose to praise and worship God greater than you ever have before. I ask for the wisdom of God to come upon you right now and that God would open up your eyes to see greater than you've ever seen, to see his direction and his will in your life in Jesus' mighty name. Glory to God. Praise God. Yes, all right, Brother Ryan. Alex, yes, we lift up your financially, relationally, and spiritually that God will pour out his blessing and grace upon you in Jesus' name. Praise God. Love, XDC. Yeah. What kind of shoes were in your dream? So, Becca, so they were, they were like these. I wear these around my house. It's just like a rubber... So it says Reebok, or it said Reebok, it said XRP. Interesting, right? I don't know. So twice I said, okay, um, I'm not, you know, buying all XRP. But um, for now, uh, a little, uh, no, I, actually about half of my portfolio right now is XRP. So that's a change for me. That's That's a big change. And I'm still praying about it. God can change things around. So, um, uh, summertime. Let's see. What, let's see. This is interesting. In crypto dream shoes, in crypto dream shoes are how we walk out a trade. XRP and slippers is bearish. It's the current drop. Hmm. That's interesting. Well, I don't know what to say about that, but thank you for your input, Summertime. God bless you, Summertime. I didn't shout you out. My heaviest is XLM. I think that's very wise. Um, yep, Thomas. Thompson, God bless you, Thompson. So if, if the other dreams are true, and none of us know 100%, and there's going to be Payment systems released with XRP April 8th. Luna Classic is about to take off and, and Shiba Inu. So that's why, guys, those are my four main coins. You know, I'm not going to miss any one of them. And if Shiba runs first, I put profits into the other ones. And if XRP is going to go, um, I will take some profits out of XRP just because I need to. <laughs> I need to. And, um, you know, I said with XRP and XLM, those coins, I'm not putting sell prices on them. But if they, if one of them happened to run a little bit first, we could have guys very. Brother Brad had this dream. He saw XRP go right to twelve dollars. There is another prophetic person in my church that just got into crypto, and the Lord is really dealing with him about XRP. And this is the word that he got. He said, "You're going to see multiple waves of price action with XRP." The Lord said, "Do not give him a warning. Do not sell at the first wave." Where's that first wave? So. That was his word, and I don't. I'm not sure how much he's holding. He might not be holding much, you know. But if I see it go ten to twenty dollars, you know, I might sell a little bit of it to roll it into XLM and, and and Luna Classic because I know the Lord showed me high prices on all four of those coins. So it's just, you know, I think it's wise to you know to to hold them. Not financial advice, of course, but just share my thoughts. 
I have two silver coins. Each has 100 XRP loaded on them. That's awesome. Wow. It's huh. amazing. Well, I guess there's a little RFD chip or something on there. How do they do that? Bless the great I am. Lord Ace. Hey, Lord Ace, God bless you. I see you on there. LOL, I've been seeing Cadillac Escalators confirmation as well. Interesting. <laughs> a pastor said get vitamin D3 and vitamin K. Yeah, so I have D3. I think I'm out of it, though. Vitamin D3 with K in it. Dr. Berg, you know, he's all over YouTube. He, um, he's he got a formula. We bought it a little while back, but I think the bottle's just about empty. Put your wallet in a Faraday bag. I guess that's what, like, for the electrical impulses and all that, AC Cobra. Um, Lewis Taylor said, absolutely. Thompson. Ah, thank you, Thompson. God bless you. 777. So I've been seeing 777 again. Roll Lady, hello. How are you? God bless you. Yes, Alex Audio needs prayer. We prayed for him. I have not. Excellent Mashiba are the two the Lord has shown me. That's awesome. I love it. I just like I like seeing different things. God's He's not giving us all the same coins, and that's okay. Getting for the transfer. The time is now in the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray right now that you release this transfer to your church. Lord, so that we could go about our business for the kingdom of God in greater ways that we could help those that are stuck, that we could help start ministries, build churches, Bible colleges, Lord God, fund orphanages, Lord God, in greater ways. I know many of us are doing that now, but in greater ways, Father. We ask that you will bless our crypto coins and our investments in Jesus' name. For those that need financial blessings, I pray financial blessings upon them right now in Jesus' mighty name. Praise God. Oh yeah, back up. Yep, I would say so. I think I think most people on here would agree with that. Likely, eclipse could serve as a confirmation for Luna Classic to move. You know, it's interesting. My wife just—you heard my testimony, my timing with crypto, and I knew the Lord was in it, and I just I did not move in the wisdom of God. This was years ago, so she just don't really like crypto too much, and. Um, you know, I lost a lot of money with it so forth. And, you know, then we went into this big trial and um, I had to really get rid of most of it at the bottom, like worst case scenario, right? I should never say worst case scenario. I take that back. It was not the worst case scenario. Um, but I'm driving today and she saw Luna. She said, Luna. And I'm like, I said, I'm proud of you, babe. <laughs> I'm proud of you for, for that to come out of your mouth. So here we are, guys. I'm ready. We're ready. We're ready. We're ready for the Lord to move. I'm seeing 7-7. Seven, seven. I'm seeing 8-8. Eight, eight. New beginnings. 7. God's completion. God's perfect will. God's, oh, hallelujah. Monique, no, I did not say that. I said that we've been preaching that for a while, but we're not 100%. So my, my spin on that was we're hoping, Monique, I'm hoping, that we'll be able to take Sheba and Luna Prophets and buy a lot of XLM and XRP. XLM and XRP might go on a little run right now. And then may, let's say they go five, ten dollars. And then Sheba and Luna bring us into the millions of dollars. Then yeah, those are still seed coins. But I don't if XRP jumps five, ten dollars, if some big news comes out, I don't want to miss it. So uh, that's why I'm saying I'm staying spread out in those um. Simpsons notice. Gee, I only got the realistic Simpsons dream about the ripple sign. I have not uh, uh, watched the Simpsons since my oldest was one or two, just turned 18. Then I didn't watch it like growing up. So I'm not sure. Yeah, I know this weird stuff with the Simpsons too. That's I don't watch that stuff neither. I don't think us as Christians, that's that's good food for the soul. <laughs> Definitely not. She went in local. Uh, yeah, I would say it's likely, but like I said, nobody knows for sure. Yeah, I don't miss it. JK, amen. Adonai, God bless you. 
Katerina Shackley, hello, husband, I need prayer for respiratory infection, please. All right, let's pray. Katerina, we lift you up right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We lift you and your husband up right now before the throne of God. We bind this respiratory infection that's affecting you in Jesus' name. We take authority over it. We loose the healing of God upon you. We speak life into your respiratory system, into your lungs, into your breathing. We speak clarity in the name of Jesus Christ. Infection, we command you to leave Katerina and her husband now in Jesus' name. We plead the blood of Jesus over your family right now, Katerina, in Jesus' name. Kaden from New Zealand, God bless you. Pray for me to obtain more XRP, XLM, and XDC, please. Thompson, yeah, we, well, yeah, we're going to pray for our, well, I just prayed for our crypto, but we pray that God will help us to attain more of these coins. Um, whatever his will, we want his will. We want his will, Thompson, for sure. I was on a work call. I thought I missed it. You have, I have a great praise report, JK said. All right, JK, let's hear it. I'll get down to it. You're, it's probably, let's see, I'm up to 717, and right now it's 726. <laughs> That's all right. I like taking my time through the comments, guys. I like connecting with you all. I like hearing what you have to say. I definitely don't want to miss any prayer requests. Um, do you think it's possible that there could be a crash of some sort in April? QB, there could be. Brother Wayne, God bless you. I see you on there. Uh, QB, there could be. I have, mm, I got maybe $53 in low buy orders. Not much, just in case. I think it's wise to have low buy orders, though the Lord really has not shown me that. One, one time he, he gave me a confirmation about it, but it wasn't, it wasn't, um, anyhow, anyhow. I don't want to get into it right now, but I, I think it's wise to have some low buy orders just in case because just, I mean, look at, Look at the world right now. This is crazy. We live in perilous times. It's crazy. We want to be prepared every which way. Uh, Katerina, also look up respiratory protocols. All right. Hey, Sister Ann, God bless you. Sister Ann says blessings to, to all. Rocket taking off with a slow lifting off the ground. I don't know if it was a dream, a crypto dream. Adonai, Adonai, Maranatha. Well, Keep praying about it. God's going to reveal it to you. Hey, Brother Dan, God bless you. God bless you. Brother Barry, God bless you. Okay, so here what I learned, gold. Gold goes up, Bitcoin goes down. That's interesting. Raul, hello. Tell us, connect to Wi-Fi for first. Oh, so they want to deal with God. Mike, I leave my XRP in a ledger. I think that's wise. What's up, Mike? God bless you. Walter, no way holding the XRP. No way holding them XRP till the end. All right. Uh, okay, so Timothy said, yes, Chip, the investment group called them XRP Army Coins. Awesome. Amen, amen. Uh, all right, and we got some prayer requests here. Let's list up, sister. And asking for prayers for my nephew. Uh, and O'Neill, God has been speaking to him and praying he will flee from his ways. Also very encouraged by your friend's testimony. Also, I was very encouraged by our brother Phil's testimony earlier. Awesome, man. All right. We lift up your nephew and O'Neill right now. We pray that God would speak to him, give him a heart for him, that he would flee his ways, that he would renounce sin, that a spirit of repentance would grab a hold of N. O'Neill, in the name of Jesus Christ, and he would turn to God wholeheartedly. We bind every spirit of addiction and attack against him in Jesus' name, and we cast it out. We loose the grace of God to touch his life, and we pray that 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 O'Neill would put his faith in God in the name of Jesus, and that God would grant him salvation in Jesus' name. Praise God. All right, Adam, let's lift you up right now. Let's lift up Brother Adam. He's living in a hotel right now where they hunt for a home. Woo. All right, Adam, we pray that the Lord would give you divine direction and favor, divine connections. I pray the Lord bless your finances, put you in the right home, in the right community. We speak it in Jesus' name. We speak it in Jesus' name that God would find a home for you and your family. In the name of Jesus Christ, that God would open that door and he would close every door that needs to close right now. We pray that he would give you wisdom and discernment 
and finding that door, going through the door that he's opened to you, finding that home that he has for you. We pray the blessing of God on your obedience, that he would give you God, you and your family a greater heart of obedience and submission unto his will and his ways in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Said a YouTube title, New Normal, Get Vitamin K. Okay, Amy. Whitfield Harrington. I've watched one or two of his videos. He's very good. Uh, you just find a legend still have access to your crypto. Even your, even if your ledger is destroyed, as long as you have your seed phrase, you can buy another ledger. Yeah. Uh, herb spice, super strength, oil of oregano, take four or five pills. Yes, oil of oregano is good. All right. All right, let's read JK, what she has here. I went to God on April 1st, just asking him about this intense journey of waiting for the wealth transfer. And as... And as I was just real with him and also brought Malachi 3 up, he brought huge financial breakthrough. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord God, for blessed JK. Thank you, Lord. And I pray that that anointing and that blessing will flow upon everybody on here right now. We thank you for blessing JK's finances. I pray that blessing upon everybody on here right now in the name of Jesus Christ. God is not a respectable person. JK, thank you for that. That is building faith, and we give God glory and thanksgiving with you. Awesome, awesome, awesome testimony. It says Fed now has been using it. The guy shows the proof. Trans well, this is why we got to be ready, guys. Don't just go by anybody's dreams. I know we esteem some of these people that are on YouTube. I'm not putting all my eggs in somebody's dream. I, I mean, I got words from the Lord. That's how I started this channel. You got words from the Lord. So this is going on. And same thing with XLM. There are banks in Europe that are already running on XLM. It's just going to be a moment of time. And these prices are out of sight for XLM and XRP. That's what I believe. Um, so Richard said, I just saw a tweet one day ago from somebody that says Fed now has been using XRP to transfer funds. The guy shows the proof of transferring of the transfer mentioning it. Yep. Oh, yeah. I was reminded, JK said, I was reminded to always go to the Father. He has the answer and everything we need. Yes, he does. I made a purchase today, and it was for 777. Awesome, Brother Barry. God is supernaturally confirming that purchase to you in Jesus' name. Praise God. Um, Troy, all right. Let's see. Let's see. Troy will share. I like you. I thank you, Troy, for. Listen, we take we take ideas from each other. Obviously, we bring everything back to the Lord, and and uh, but I like hearing what people are doing. Not investment advice. I'm using seventy percent of Lunk and Shib as seed, fifteen percent long term, and fifteen percent sell orders. Awesome. I like that, Troy. Thank you for sharing that. We use a covenant between men and the Lord is a covenant with your feet, meaning well. Becca, this is awesome because when I started this this financial trial that I've been in, I saw for I made a video a long time ago. Many many of you have probably seen it. Maybe some of you have not. I, I would run this hill. I, I hate doing distance running, but I, I needed to do cardio. And I would run, it was about a hundred meter hill behind my house, the block behind my house. And it was my business was like growing every year from 2018 to about 2022. And coming into the 2022 season, it was seasonal uh, where I got a lot more work in the spring and summer. I would get decent work in the fall and the winter would be very slow. And I'm running this hill and I'm thinking like, God, it, now it's already like May and I barely have any work. And my work starts really coming in in like March. And I'm running this hill and I get to the top and I turn around and there's a rainbow across the sky and there is no clouds in the sky. Usually there's rainbows, there's some clouds, stuff like that, a little bit of rain. And um, the Lord immediately speaks to me. He spoke to me so powerfully. I started crying, which does not happen a lot. And I'm, I start looking around because it was a nice day out. I'm like, are people seeing me like run this hill crying now? <laughs> so the Lord says, I am a covenant keeping God. 
Don't look to your crypto, your bank account, or your business. I will provide for you. I am a covenant keeping. I'm a covenant keeping God. So I received this, Becca. Sandals in the Old Testament are used for covenant between men and maybe the Lord making a covenant with your feet, meaning your walk. Amen. 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 Joshua, hello. God bless you, Joshua. The Simpsons have a rapture episode. Yeah, every now and then I see him on like YouTube short. Uh, super strength oil of oregano. Yep, I've, I've been into that. Colloidal silver, some other ones. Uh, the lighthouse. God bless you. Monique, hello. Oh, Monique, I, maybe. I'm sorry if I said, if I was, was giving you guys your shout out and I already shouted you guys out because there's like 110 people on right now. Uh, Lord Times of Crypto reminded me about Psalms 112. My first thought is he's not playing about his children, those coming to him. It's about to go down. Amen. And it's about to go down. God bless the body of Christ. Who knows it, man? All right. This interview is of my friend that God first used to let me step into and that traffic works. I'm so excited about God. We do an impact to fight trafficking on hearts. That's awesome, JK. Awesome, awesome. Jesus, help us to prepare. Amen, amen. Amen. You had a word of knowledge about a shoulder injury. I claimed yesterday I was playing with my son, throwing the football without any pain. Wow, Mike, praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for healing, Brother Mike. Thank you, Lord. We give you glory, praise, and honor right now in Jesus' name. You had a word of knowledge about a shoulder injury. I claim it yesterday. I was playing with my son, throwing the football without any pain. That hasn't happened since before my work injury. Mike, please put down the Telegram page. We talked about testimonies, how powerful our testimonies are. Somebody needs to hear that. That'll build faith, and it also glorifies God. And you know what? L look at this. One, one, one. I was going to get into numbers with you all. I'm just probably not going to have time tonight, but I do want to share that. Triplicate numbers. Hear this, Brother Mike and everybody on here. God's numbers is one, one, one. God, the one. Um. Let me just read this. The possessive form of the word Jehovah appears exactly 111 times in the Bible. Here are some other biblical words and phrases with the numerical value of 111 or 111. 111 equals wonderful, Isaiah 9, 6. 111 equals great wonder, nurturer, rod, the most high, the house, my father's house, the root of Jesse. The Lord um, equals 111 times 9, Luke 143. Let me, uh, let me, let me just, there's, there's a scripture. Deuteronomy 111, may the Lord God of your fathers make you a thousand times more numerous than you are and bless you as he has promised you. That's Deuteronomy 111. Joshua 111, pass through the camp and command the people saying, prepare provisions for yourselves. Within three days, you will cross over this Jordan to go in to possess the land which the Lord your God is giving you to possess. Praise God, we're crossing over, guys. There's a lot of, um, but this is the one, Mike, brother Mike, this is the one that stands out to me. When I was getting 111 a lot, this was the script, the original scripture the Lord brought me to, Mark 1, 1, 1, chapter 1, verse 11. Then the voice came from heaven, Mike, the Lord is saying, you are my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. 1, 1, 1. Awesome. Praise God. That's awesome. Woo. Gold and silver prices are soaring today, Brother Barry said. All right. Derek said, hold XRP, hit that like button. Thank you, thank you, guys. Yes, yes, yes. Um, awesome. Amy said, I topped up on some XRP, XDC, SHIB, and ladies. The ladies coin, I heard about that. Haven't really got into it. Awesome. 
Silver and gold is at all time high. Good to have on hand, guys. What are what are the two new currencies that are going to be backed by silver and gold? So silver and gold are already taken off. Why? Because this thing's playing out underneath our noses. Not underneath our noses. We know about it, but the world's about to find out about it. XRP, digital gold, and XLM, digital silver. The first dream I had XRP, I told you guys, I saw a black bag. I saw three black bags. And it said XRP in gold on the bags. Woo, JK is praying for uh, Awesome. Thank you, JK. There's a frizzle. Jesus, please remove my bitterness. May the Lord remove your bitterness and pull the it's a root of bitterness. He's got to pull that up. You got to get to the root and give that to the Lord. Whatever that root of bitterness is, expose yourself to it. Give it to the Lord so He can heal you. And the mouse homeless. Meditated on scripture and Psalms. Amen. Praise God. And said here for Adam, Psalms 37, 25 through 26. She said when she was homeless, she meditated on these scriptures. Hey, Naomi, God bless you. All right. Human trafficking stories rocked me in the gospel. All right, JK, put this up there. Here's the interview about the anti-trafficking. So good, YouTube human trafficking stories rocked me. Yep, I got a burn for that too. You know, my church in, in Houston, we, um, I, I, I don't even know if I'm supposed to talk about it, but we, we minister to them. We minister to them. Uh, but it's kind of like, it's it's a special thing that God is doing. So it's it's not really released to all the public. Raul, I see you. God bless you. I'm sorry. I'm used to what used to all oh, this too. Ancient rival, right? No problem. Ancient rival. Amen. Naomi, praise the Lord for it. Unless you be tomorrow. I'm very interested in this job, please. All right, Jeff. Let's lift up Brother Jeff right now. All right. Brother Jeff said, I have a job interview for an elementary uh, PE, physical uh, education teaching job tomorrow. I'm very interested in this job. Please pray for me. The interview goes well and that I have favor. All right, Jeff, we lift you up right now. We pray the Lord. We pray the will of the Lord be done in this job interview, that God's favor and grace will be upon you, that he'll give you favor with the people that are interviewing you, that God will give you the words to say, that God would open this door for you, close every door that needs to be closed. And we pray that God would bless this for you, Jeff. We speak the blessing of God over this. We speak the life of God. We pray that God would take you into this interview and God would bless this interview in the name of Jesus Christ. And if it be his will that you will get this job and it'll be a sure thing and God will bless this new career for you in this new school in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise God. Praise God. Yes, Sister Shannon, that's what I saw before. I'm a little, I'm a little slow on these comments. XRP Sandals, I mentioned it would carry long-term financial currency. Similar with your inter confirmation for me. Awesome. 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 Uh, I see that Trixie in 2004. Yes. Blood of Jesus over our family. All right, Amy, let's pray. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ over our families right now in Jesus' mighty name. I speak healing and unity over our families. I speak restoration over our families. Father, restore and heal marriages and families right now in Jesus' name. I speak a special covering over our families, Lord. As the world is getting crazier and crazier, we speak covering over our families right now in the name of Jesus Christ. You know what? Let's let's read let's read Psalm 91. I want to pray against. All right. You all see this. Let me play it for you guys, okay? Because this is what I want to pray against. Highly contagious pathogen jumping from bird to cow to human. Texas health officials issuing a statewide alert after the first confirmed case of human infection with bird flu that came from a dairy farm. USDA confirms the avian influenza virus has infected cattle in Texas and elsewhere after wild birds were found dead on farms there and may have contaminated the feed. A highly contagious pathogen right. jumping. Anyhow, this is what's going on. This is 
the world we're living in. But we've been talking about authority. We've been talking about dominion. It's going to be different this time around. We're not going to back down. We are going to step up as the church of the living God, and we are going to take authority. I speak that this any pandemic, plague, whatever it is, is not going to touch our families in Jesus' name. Psalm 91, he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Lord, bring us under your shadow, for we will abide in your secret place. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver thee from the, no from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He will deliver us from the pestilence. We are delivered from the pestilence. Our families are delivered from the pestilence. Our churches are delivered from the pestilence. In Jesus' name, he shall cover thee with his feathers. We are covered with the feathers of the Lord. Under his wings shall we trust. His truth shall be our shield, our buckler, our bulwark, our strong tower. Thou shalt not be afraid. We will not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day nor for the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor for the destruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at our side and 10,000 at our right hand, but it shall not come near us. This pestilence shall not come near us, nor our families. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, we take authority over this pestilence. We bind it in Jesus' name and we cast it out in the name of Jesus. Lord God, raise up a standard upon the church. Raise up a standard upon our families right now in the name of Jesus Christ. A thousand may fall at our side, 10,000 at our right hand. But I decree and declare it shall not come near the church of the living God. It will not come near our children. It will not come near our spouses, our families. It will not come near our churches in the name of Jesus Christ. We bind the avian flu. We bind it in Jesus' name. What we bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. And what we loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. And we loose the healing virtue of God over our families right now. We loose the provision of God over our families right now. For we are called for such a time as this. Church, we're going to rise up. We're going to take our marching orders and we will not back down for the Lord has not given us the spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. I pray right now for a fresh baptism of fire to come upon us right now in the name of Jesus. I pray for steel to come in our backbone. We will not bow to Baal as churches bowed in 2020. We will not bow to Baal this time, but we will rise up as the church of the living God. We will preach the word. We will decree life and salvation over this lost and dying world. I bind the plans of the enemy, the spirit of Antichrist we bind in Jesus' name. And I decree and declare it's not his time. Yes, his word says he tries to change the times and the seasons, but it's not his time. I speak that it's the time for the church of the living God. And it's our time to rise up and take our God-given place and authority now in the name of Jesus Christ. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over the church right now. The blood of Jesus afresh over us right now. I speak the peace of God that passeth all understanding to guard our minds and our hearts right now in Christ Jesus. And I pray that we are taking our marching orders. We're not going to back down. We're going to pray more than ever. We're going to fast more than ever. We are going to move forward in the name of Jesus Christ. We are not backing down. We are not cowering down. But we are moving forward in Jesus' name. We're going to speak the word of God. We're going to take the sword of the spirit. Matter of fact, let's, pull, let's armor up. We put on the helmet of salvation. Lord, give us the mind of Christ. Protect our thoughts from the wicked one, Father. We take the shield of faith to quench all the fiery darts of the enemy. We decree and declare we will walk by faith and not by sight. Yes, Brother Wayne, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. The Lord is raising up a standard and he's raising up a hedge right now in the name of Jesus. We put on the breastplate of righteousness. Lord, put our feet on paths of righteousness. Let our thoughts, our actions, our words be all in 
righteousness. We gird our loins with truth. Lord, protect us and our families. Lord God, everybody on here, protect us from the deception of the enemy, for we will stand on the truth of your word. Lord, for your word have we hid in our heart that we sin not against thee. Thy word is a light and a lamp to our path. Thy word has cleansed us. The entrance of thy word giveth light. It giveth understanding until the sin unto the simple. Wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way by taking heed thereto according to thy word. Thy word is sharp and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit and of the joints and the marrow. And it's a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. We take the sword of the spirit which is the word of God. It's the rhema word of God. It's the now word of God. And we decree and declare that we are a triumphant church. We decree and declare that we are accepted in the beloved. We decree and declare that nothing shall separate us from the love of God. We decree and declare that we will be lend, we will be lenders and not borrowers in this season. We decree and declare that we will be courageous and we will march on with the army of the Lord and we will take ground from the enemy in the name of Jesus Christ. We decree and declare that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. We decree and declare that we are dwelling in the secret place of the Most High and we are abiding under the shadow of the Almighty. We decree and declare that no pestilence will touch us or have dominion over us in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. We shot our feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. We will go forth and preach the word of God that Christ was buried. He was crucified, buried, and rose again on the third day. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah, hallelujah. Yes, Brother Wayne. Yes, Brother Wayne. And I like even the, the, the preceding scriptures. Go to all the world, preach the gospel. Them that believe and are baptized shall be saved in my name. They shall take up serpents if they drink anything deadly. It shall not. It shall in no means hurt them. It even says they will speak in new ter new tongues, which is a language you've never learned. And that happens when you're baptized in the Holy Ghost. They shall lay hands on the sick and they shall recover. Yes, I decree and declare, everybody, we are going to lay hands on the sick. And we are going to expect them to recover. Matter of fact, we're going to expect the sick to recover when we lay hands on them, that we're going to be shocked if God does not heal them. That's the attitude. Expectation is the highest level of faith in my eyes. That when we pray, we expect and we believe that in this season, we are going to lay hands on the sick. And I'm, I'm doing it now in my church. Glory to God. We're seeing healings. But I'm believing. You're going to believe. We're going to believe together that when we lay hands on the sick, that they will recover. Because that's the word of God that Brother Wayne just shared. That's the word of God. And so much so we're going to believe and expect that if it does not happen, we are going to be shocked that it doesn't happen. Praise God. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Beck. Yes. Lord, let thy kingdom come. Let thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Let your kingdom come, Father. Let your will be done. On earth as it is in heaven. In heaven there's no devils, there's no sickness, there's no disease, there's perfect peace, there's joy, there's love. And that's what we're calling down. That's why prayer is so powerful and faith is so powerful. It's the bridge. All that Christ has blessed us with all spiritual blessings. Well, where are they? They're in glory. My God shall provide all of your need according to his riches and glory. It's faith that's the bridge to pull them from there to us. And prayer, of course, is tied into that. So we reach, Lord, we pray, we speak, and we call forth heaven onto earth. Therefore, we cast out devils. That's why he sent them by twos, to heal the sick, to cast out devils, to proclaim the year of the Lord, to tell them that the kingdom of God is near them. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Sister Sharon, God bless you. We love you, Sister Sharon. We thank you for your channel. You're one of the first people that I found on here. So you're near and dear to me and many others. Praise God. And most of the people on here are probably following your channel. But if you're not, y'all, give, give Sister Sharon from Now Daily Bread a follow. 
She is a humble woman, woman of God. Praise God. And I'm honored to have her on here today. Thank you, Sister Shem. Thank you. Thank you. We pray the Lord blesses you and your ministry and your channel a hundredfold in the name of Jesus Christ. And we pray a covering over you that God will continue to enable you. You bless your finances and, and your giftings and your, your influence that you will continue to, to increase and multiply for the kingdom of God and for the sake of revival in Jesus' mighty name. All right, in Jesus' name. God bless you, son. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. Sister Shannon, God bless you, Sister Shannon. I need prayer tonight for healing my body. I feel some sort of respiratory infection coming out, but rebuke it in the name of Jesus. All right, in the name of Jesus Christ. Sister Shannon, we lift up Sister Shannon right now. We bind that respiratory infection in the name of Jesus Christ, and we command it to leave now in Jesus' name. We loose the healing virtue of God upon you, Shannon, right now in Jesus' name. I speak for your lungs to be healed, every cell in your body to be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. I speak the strength of God to come upon you right now. I decree and declare that by the stripes of Jesus Christ, you are healed in Jesus' name. You're healed in your lungs. We bind the infection in Jesus' name, and we cast it out, and we loose the healing of God upon you, Shannon, in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, yes. Everybody's giving Sister sister Sharon some love. Amen, amen. Amen, amen, amen. All right. Praise God, praise God. Well, Sister, Sh sister Sharon, while I got you on here, I, I want to ask you a question. Um, when How I found you and Brother Keith and Brother Drew are, are the first three. When I started having dreams about Luna Classic and my initial reaction was, I don't want to buy that coin because it was right after it crashed. And the Lord, it was so, I mean, he spoke to me so, so clear. There was no question in my mind. It was the Lord. He said, the well's going to buy Luna Classic. And then you put out dreams and brother Keith and brother Drew. And I'm like, all right, I'm not going crazy. You know, and then God was leading me like, oh, I need to start putting out these videos on a YouTube channel. But I was a little late. God really had a, you know, to, to work on me to, to, to begin to do that. Um, I just want to know if you felt you still on track with everything with Luna Classic, if God has spoken to you at all about Luna Classic. And what's interesting, Shannon, Sister Sharon, with you too, is God, I, I think you shared that you've had one dream about Shiba Inu. And I've had one, but it was very profound. But, you know, God is not really, he's spoken a lot more to me about Luna Classic. That's why I was always a little heavier with my bag with Luna Classic, actually a lot heavier. Um, but one time I did have a dream and, he, and the Lord told me it was an angel, I believe, that came up to me. It was in human form. It was actually uh, it was one of my pastors in New York. And he said he, he told me to buy 50 to 60 million Shiba Inu for the church. And that was it. That was but it was a pretty direct dream. Um, but you still. Are, all right. All right. Thank you. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, we're waiting. It's we're we're here. We're coming close. So, um, you know, we're sharing ideas, and most importantly, I think just we're at an hour. Right. Most important is for us to pray together. It's just for us to pray together. God's given these promises, these words, and it's so much more. I like to tell everybody on here that the wealth transfer is just a small little piece of what God is doing. This is so much bigger. This is revival. This is mass healings that are going to go forth, mass revival, souls coming into the kingdom. The wealth transfer, which brought a lot of us together, is just a sliver of a, a tool of what God is going to use to help enable this revival. And I know we're all kind of preaching that, you know. So, you know, we're kind of shifting gears over here, too, and getting more into prayer. The Lord has been pressing upon me to share the word and, and to really just come on here and step into my call and, and, and help pastor and lead and guide by no means superseding anybody else's pastor, by no means. And I've made that clear to everybody on here. But everybody on here is so supportive. And we we are the church of the living God. And I thank God for everybody on here. Love you all. Um, Brother P.S. All right, I would love to do that. Sister, Sh Sister Sharon, we got a request. We could do a live sh session one day. I would love to do that. Maybe I'll, I'll have to uh, message you and... And um, we'll try to set something up. That would be great. I know you're in the UK, so it's probably pretty late for you right now. <laughs> amen, amen. I know I'm, I'm an hour from New York, and probably the UK is probably another three hours from New York. Um, all right, let's see. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anybody's 
prayer requests before we get off. Um, Amy, I bind autism. So Amy had a prayer request. Amy, I'm sorry if I missed you. Amy, if I missed your prayer request because a bunch came up here, please type it in. Uh, Shib and they were saying it was foolish. I prayed in my heart, asked God, I looked right. And the Shib dog, wow. <laughs> that's great, JK. Funny story, I was talking to someone about Shib and they were saying it was foolish. I prayed in my heart to ask God and look to the right and the Shib dog walked right by. I laughed aside. Yeah, I I definitely believe God is, is, um, is behind Shiba Inu and Shiba Inu will go. Okay, Amy, I see the prayer request. Let's pray um, for Bella. Bella has been coming on the Telegram group, Amy's sweet daughter. <clears throat> so we lift her up right now. Let's bind together and pray for Bella. We, we lift up Bella right now be, before the throne of grace. We bind the autism. We bind the spirit of autism in the name of Jesus Christ. And we command it to leave Bella now in Jesus' name. We take authority over that autism and we command it to leave Bella in the name of Jesus Christ that God would loose her from this, that God would touch her brain in areas that may be undeveloped, and that God would step in as the creator and touch and heal Bella in the name of Jesus Christ. We decree and declare that by the stripes of Jesus Christ, Bella is healed in Jesus' mighty name. Praise God. Amen, Brother Wayne. That's awesome. Love that scripture. He brought forth also with silver and gold, and there was not one feeble person among their tribes talking about Israel. Amen. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, praise. Joy of life. Hey, joy of life. A 7.4 magnitude earthquake just hit Taiwan. Wow. So let's lift up Taiwan right now. In the name of Jesus, we lift up Taiwan. Lord, protect this nation. We pray for revival in this nation. But Lord, protect people. Lord, if anybody who's affected by this earthquake, Lord God, that you would send in help, Father, to get those people out. We pray, Lord God, against casualties. We pray your healing over the nation of Taiwan right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray you'd send angels down there to rescue people, Lord God, in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. All right, be positive. My son William returns to Christ and the enemy can't stop in Jesus' name. Yes, we come in agreement with be positive for their son William. Be positive, son William, in the name of Jesus. We pray that he would return, that God would give him visions and dreams, that God would stir up his desire, his faith, and his want to for relationship with Jesus Christ once again. In Jesus' name, we claim his salvation. We speak that he is going to come home in the name of Jesus Christ, back to the house of God where he belongs in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise God. All right, guys, I'm going to pop off. It's been a little over an hour. Appreciate everybody that came on. Love you all. Oh, oh, hey, I got one more on here. I saw you. Arrow. Hey, Arrow, God bless you. Thank you for coming on. Pastor, please pray for my son Joshua. Come back to Christ. Our Lord and God, amen. Let Jesus heal him. All right, Arrow, we're going to pray for, you. for Joshua. We just prayed for William, and we're going to pray for all the prodigals because that's the heartbeat of God amongst other things this season, in Jesus' name. So we lift up Ariel's son, Joshua, right now, and all the prodigals, that the Lord would bring them back in the name of Jesus Christ, that God would dispel the darkness that the enemy sowed in their hearts, that they once again would see the light of the glorious gospel of Jesus Christ. We bind every spirit of affliction and attack against Joshua and all the prodigals in Jesus' name, we cast it out. Bring them home, Lord. We claim their salvation. We claim them as children of God. They're your children, Lord God. They're still in your hands. We rebuke the enemy off of their lives right now in Jesus' name. Lord, stir up their passion, increase their passion, their hunger, and their thirst for the living God once again and bring them back into relationship with you. In Jesus' name we pray. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. Amen, amen, amen. Come back in Jesus' name. All right. Yes, amen. Thank you, guys, everybody, for praying. We are the body of Christ. I love you all. Appreciate you all. I'm going to jump off now, and uh, I will see you guys tomorrow, um, probably late morning, early afternoon. And... Uh, Everybody have a blessed night. Thank you guys for praying and coming on. Love you all. Appreciate you all. And everybody have a great night in Jesus' name. Ball cap, I see you on there. 
anybody, if I missed you, Lewis, God bless you. If I missed you, I apologize. But appreciate you all. Have a great night, everybody. In Jesus' name, I speak victory over everybody on here right now. We are victorious in Christ. I speak peace, love, and joy. Hope fill our hearts and our families right now in Jesus' mighty name. Where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. I speak the liberty of God over our mind, heart, soul, and emotions right now in Jesus' name. Praise God. All right, y'all. God bless you all. Have a great night.